snows at the top of the mountains, way over there. Ooh! What's up with you? You've hardly been talking to us lately. I don't know, I've just been thinking. About what? Snowflakes? Do you want to build a... No! I've been thinking about how Guckaroo saved me on shipwreck cliffs when I almost fell. That's just what we do. We look out for one another. We're a team. Mm, guys, I think I need to tell you something. <laughs> guys! Look! It's beautiful! We have to go through Revelation Mountains to get to Snowman's Island. Why do we have to go through Revelation Mountain to see Snowman's Island? Guys, we don't have to go to Snowman's Island. We just have to see it. We always seem to be looking for some type of clue. And we had to navigate through the Revelation Mountains to get to this very spot to see Snowman's Island. Figuring out this one was really tricky because you have to think you're going to Snowman's Island, but really you have to know your Bible. Paul was only one man and made many friends along the way and turned his back on being alone. So we need to have Snowman's Island to our back and face forward so we can find the clue. There it is! To unlock this box, your head can't be full of rocks. You need much more than the things you've heard. You must fill your head and heart with the... We just walked through the Revelation Mountains. The Revelation is the clue. We learned in the desert Paul got all of his revelations straight from Jesus and then spent time in God's Word. The answer is Word! Treasure on Treasure Island. We're rich! We won! Wait, Ducky, that Dracula coin from Ephesus is another clue. Look in the box. There's a paper. Revivals and riots alike, all were common in Paul's walk. Although his travels may sometimes seem bleak, you can find the answers you seek at Paul. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. Wait, what does that mean? It means that Paul traveled near and far telling people about the good news of Jesus Christ. That's it, the answer to the clue is Paul's peak. Guys, before we go, I have to tell you something. I've not been honest with you guys. I've seen how you guys have all helped me and each other and when Buckaroo, when we were at Shipwreck Cliffs, she saved me. And then I heard all the stories about the Apostle Paul and what he went through to tell everyone about Jesus and I'm the traitor. <laughs>